Over the years, people have settled along the Red Sea, where once there was a desert inhabited by Bedouins, we can now find cities with comfort and amenities, not only for the villagers, but also for visitors whose demands help to create a more modern society. Many houses have their own purpose, as one can see from the signs on the buildings. Construction sites are rising everywhere, even under the sea. Numerous sea creatures gather on the reefs, similar to cities with multitudes of homes and inhabitants. These little damselfish shelter in the coral, while the goldfish feel at home exploring the reef in a shoal. Bubbles produced by divers exploring the caves of the city endanger the habitat of the sweepers. Close to the shore, a shoal of glassfish reside under a barge, accompanied by their landlords, the linefish. Every now and then, the linefish claim directly his rent, only noticed by one habitant of the swarm. Sand divers deserve their name. Ghost pipefish are well hidden amongst dead leaves. Amazing, these two have stayed, despite many swimmers. Rubbish, thrown in the sea by careless men, is transformed miraculously to a habitat by sea creatures. One of the most venomous fish, the stonefish, waddles over to multicolored structures. Melting into the landscape, he awaits passing prey. In the seagrass, looking out from his burrow, is the eel. Close by is a lone seahorse. His colors blend perfectly with the grass in which he lives. This makes this little immobile creature difficult to spot. In the animal, the clownfish fans its eggs, fixed to the amphora. Close by, an anemone shrimp dances on the outer tentacles. Sea urchins provide shelter to many creatures. Even under the sea, houses can be overcrowded. Beware. Everybody watches. Leaving your home carelessly puts you at risk. Slender eels dance in the current to catch food. At the slightest alert, they retreat in their homes. The goby, like a watchdog, stands on the lookout while the blind shrimp clears up their apartment. Not every fish is that lucky. This little fellow has to do his dirty work himself. Living underwater 
makes one clever at finding security and shelter in the oddest places. Seen through human eyes, this moray eel seems to be in prison. The frogfish has just arrived in a new location. The residents gaze at him and query their safety. A loner does not worry about a safe home. Known for its venomous skin, the nudie branch is rarely disturbed. For others, predators looking for an easy prey come unannounced in their home. As the sun sets, some fish get prepared for the night in a safe nook on the reef. Divers watch the nightlife, mainly creatures searching for food. In the darkness, the predators rely on their excellent smell, taste and sight to find food and avoid being eaten. This octopus is safe in his habitat, an empty shell. While some rest with watchful eye, others hunt, each in their own way. Divers also hunt. Done with care, their photo shooting is harmless. This lucky diver has found the fabulous Queen of the Night, the Spanish dancer. Satisfied by their hunt and replete, the creatures retire to their home, under the sand, between crevices or rocks, for a well-deserved rest. For all those living above and below the sea, a safe, secure home is vital. <laughs>